Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Conquest Bad Fur Day. In the last episode, we went into the barn, cut Frankie down, used him to defeat the haystack. We fell down here, and then we defeated the the haystack for the final time, which you could say marks him as a final, as the first um, boss in the game. So in this episode, we are going to escape from this region and probably have time to do some more stuff. Also, but that just depends. So yeah. You want to go to the pipe that says exit on it because you can't see the ladders on the back. Each one has a ladder on the back, but they're at different levels, so you just have to go to the one that says exit on it. So go to B, and I believe in order to throw your knives, you need to press Z. Yeah. So you want to aim for the part where that connects the pipe to the actual um, thing that it's hanging from. There's one down there too. This one NCS missed, which is why he was dying all the time. So did I miss any? Yes, I did. Okay, so there's three there's three of these um wires that you need to cut on this first platform. Alright. So I think the next one you need to go over to is this one. Yes, there's a ladder hanging from it that you can get to from here. <clears throat> so just get on over. You got plenty of time. You should have plenty of time, if, unless it took you forever to get those pi the, to get those wires. Uh oh. Okay. Now it's crunch time. Climb the ladder, dude. Thank you. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was on the wrong side of the ladder. I'm an idiot. All right. So there should be another B pad here somewhere. Oh, it's on top. All right. Where are the wires? There I go. Cut that one down. And now we need to cut that one down as well. Cut down. I can't see it. I can't even see it. It's too far away. There we go. Beautiful. Did we get them all? No. Come on. That was it. No. Alright. A little lower. Come on. Yes. So, okay, you cut three wires down on the first pipe, and then you cut three down wires down on the second pipe, and that ought to do it for you. <coughs> so now we just got to get out of here. There's a little exit that this water level raises you to, very conveniently, by the way. And I think that the water level stops as soon as it gets to the exit, so you can't drown. So that's good, because you don't know how to swim yet. Underwater, at least. That takes time. All right, so we're out of here. Yay! I don't know why they built a door so far up, but... Whatever. It's like the doors built in the ceiling of my high school. Make no sense, but whatever. <coughs> Just, I'm going to turn the other cheek. It's video game logic. Okay, so that way is blocked off, so we can't go that way. So let's talk to this guy. Hey, buddy. What can we do? Buddy? Buddy? What? Yeah. So all you got to do is get on his stone in Conquer Live and Reloaded. He doesn't go... <laughs> and then throw you up. He actually just says, Get off my stone! And that's probably my favorite line from that game specifically. You're like in the wall. <laughs> and now you're over here. That makes no who sense. Who wants to be a millionaire? Me, actually. Is who wants to be a millionaire that old? Huh? Crazy. It's a pretty old game show. Alright, well. That's fine. Alright, we're out of here. Cool beans. And with that, we've almost completed this area, but we're not quite there yet. There's one last thing we gotta do. So you may recognize where we are. We're actually on top of the barn, and that's the bucket where we were earlier to gather the bees to help um, attract the sunflower to King Bee, <coughs> or at least let her guard down. <laughs> Alright, so you gotta watch out. The wasps are patrolling, and that's okay. If you fall, you're you are boned, so you need to get as close up as possible, and then go, 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 mother effer. Okay, so don't move when he knocks you off. You'll land in a safe spot, but if you move everywhere, then he's going to kick your butt. Oh, come on. Okay, I really don't know how to do this. This guy's going to kick my bum. Um, And I'm saying bum because Conker speaks in an English accent, and I just decided to be English for some reason. I don't know. Come on. And all the way down, and I lived! What? Well, that didn't make any sense. 
All right, let's go in here. I know there's chocolate in here, and I'm a glutton, so um, let's see. There's one more. I know it. No? Okay. Fine. Whatever. What ifs? All right, let's get out of here. Should be a chocolate again. All right? Yeah, good. All right, and that should just about fill us up so we can go for round two with that wasp. The sea... <coughs> this is the main reason why I don't like this final task in this area. Not that fun for me. I'm not really skilled at it. Hmm. Okay, so... Do we have to wait for him to take a break or something? You gonna take a break, bro? How close can we get without you hitting us? I'm gonna risk it there. Yes, 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 go! Yes! Yes! Okay. We've made it. And our reward? Good. Okay, so I hope this guy doesn't knock us off to the left and instead knocks us off to the right. Because we have plenty of leeway on the right and no leeway on the left. Is that the same wasp? Are there only three wasp skins? Whatever. You can be wasp crony number 876 for all I care. Let's just go. And there should be another one. Yes. Okay. Let's just get past this wasp. And once you get past him, he actually switches to up here. So that's kind of... Oh! That's a tricky one. He switched back down. Okay. So, yeah. He's not that hard to get past, though. So what you want to do is you want to jump off this plank. And then press B. Press B. B! 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 Oh. Oh, 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 oh. I pressed Z. Oh no, Conquer. Well, we get to meet Greg. Dead. <laughs> oh my god, everything is vulgar. But then again, it's the Grim Reaper. So maybe he has the right, considering he's death incarnate. Aren't you a little shot to be a Grim Reaper? Well, how many Grim Reapers have you met before, mate? What, what am I supposed to look like? Yeah, that's a good point. Well made. Now. Yeah, see. pretty good. Ah, yes. Conker. Surname? The Squirrel. The Squirrel. The squirrel. <laughs> oh, bloody hell, you would have to be a... Alright, listen to his dialogue here. I'm gonna be quiet. Why, is there a problem with that? Well, yes, there is, actually. It's like those bloody cats. Such a pain in the ass. You're one of these special cases. Listen to cats. Oh, really? Yes. Apparently, They're a special case. Remember, they have the nine lives. That be, I'm just doing my job. I do what I'm told. I don't even get paid very much. Apparently, squirrels can have as many lives as they think they can get away with. Oh, I see. So I'm not dead. No, dead, but not quite. <laughs> right. Well, I'll, uh, I'll be off then. D just you wait, smart ass. You don't get out of it that quickly. <laughs> now, okay. the thing is, you may not be dead, but that doesn't mean you can't die. You just have a few more. Shall we say, chances? This is very brilliant idea by Rare. <laughs> Cats have nine lives. They have a set number of lives. We can find lives. Squirrels' tails. Yes. You can get Those give us lives. I'll give you an extra chance. Understand? Um. Well, sounds a bit strange, but okay. The best bloody deal you're going to get, you little Meat. Right. That's it. It's off. Oh, and Live and Reloaded, he says mate, I think. Bloody things. I hate those bloody cats. No. Where they Never meow mind. and they piss everywhere. And their shit <laughs> smells just bloody awful. <laughs> oh, he's just bad-mouthing the cats. Yay, I got a tail. All right. So let's go. Hey, bro. There's that sound effect again. Awesome. Ooh, we're here. Good. So how many tails we got left? Two. Oh, wow. All right. Well, that begs some questions, but that's okay. Video game logic. 
I don't know how we got the other two tails, but now we have three lives. So, okay. Let's just do it. So we got to the top of the ladder earlier. I'm just going to go ahead and cut ahead because we've already done this. Okay, so we're at the top now. And now we're going to do it again without failing. So A, A, B. B, B, B. Yes. Good. Wee. Bang. Yeah, see, last time we did that in our human self, or in our squirrel self, and it didn't work that well for us. So, see, that opens the gate down there. Now, I believe in the Live and Reloaded version, it's full of dolls that are really, really freaky little things, and they can kill you easily. And also, there's money in there. No, dead. Yeah. No, don't make me get down this way. Balls. All right. Well, no, wait. That's not too far. We can do that. Land in the water. Land in the water. Land in the water. Land in the water. Yes! Success! All right. Now that we've opened that way, let's go inside and get that tail. Tail. Oh wait, I'm here in money. Is there money? Hey, there is money. All right, so we're fine. Nothing changed from live and reloaded. Good, good. So what's that put us up to? 400? You can hit start and check your money. One second. I'm gonna have that gold card before you know it. What? Oh. You know what, let's just look, let's just look at his cutscenes for a while. Hold on. Okay, so we're up to 500. 500 dollars, wow. We're making some pretty good progress for, what, six episodes? I should be calling this now, but there's one more thing. Is there one more thing that I gotta take care of? No! We're pretty much done with this area. Oh, yeah, this is one of the worst parts of this game. The name of the magazine is Beaver something uh -huh. yeah so he's looking at beaver something yeah just get past that okay so now that we've completed this area and there's really nothing else to do i'm gonna call it here and we're gonna go on to the next area in the next episode so thank you guys for watching this episode of conquer's bad fur day i'm going to finish my granola bar and my soda now mm. I hope you're enjoying the gluttony playthrough. Um, 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 um. So, I don't know how you guys are going to feel about this. I'm not sure whether or not this playthrough is going to make you laugh or make you hungry. Or both. Or neither. You never know. But, uh, hopefully it'll be a hit. I don't know. I'm enjoying this game, certainly. Mm. So good. So, in the next episode, we're going to get out of this area. Out that way. And we're going to go to the next area that, that splits off on the left. And uh, that's got its own story, and you're going to learn that next episode. Because <laughs> it's a bit of a crude one. So, thank you guys for watching. Until next time, see you guys later. Well, I'm sure it sounded like I was having a seizure when I was drinking that last bit of soda, but I needed an excuse to say, now's not the time to play video games. It's the time to drink soda.